Hey guys, what's up? So yesterday was a pretty interesting day for the um, for Apple. You know, uh, we got iPad OS uh, fourteen, um, iOS fourteen, Watch OS seven, and um, obviously um, Mac OS Big Sur. But uh, this video is just uh, specifically just a quick short video about um, iPad OS fourteen, what's new and. Uh, yeah, you know, this is not an in-depth review, just a quick video, so, yeah. Before we get into today's video, guys, I want to spend just a minute to talk about the affiliate of this video. This video is affiliated with Razer. Razer makes some of the highest quality gaming gear out there, guys, from keyboards, mice, headsets, and much, much more. Grab your gear today and level up your game. Check it out in the description below. Okay guys, so um, in terms of uh, new things in uh, iPadOS, most of the stuff is just carrying over from iOS um, with a few new, uh, new, new things uh, or um, I would say different things. The widgets are not on the home screen. Um, we've got some new widgets here. Uh, other than that, um, all the other widgets are um, just on the side here. Uh, now, um, one of my favorite features about um, uh, the new thing is this uh, search bar here. So we have the search bar and obviously guys, if you haven't watched the keynote, uh, you guys wouldn't know this, but now with Apple Pencil on iPadOS, what you can do is in any text field, you could just go and say some like, if I want YouTube, I could just go here and write YouTube out and it will actually convert it. And then I could go for a search and yeah, that's one of my favorite features. And while we're on the um, note of the search bar, guys, this is uh, Apple's new universal search bar type of thing. Um, basically, you can just uh, search something here and uh, it can literally take you to an app and go search in that app for the exact thing. It can search the browser and a lot more stuff like that. And next up, uh, another new thing we have is if I go for Siri, um, as you can see, new Siri, Siri is just right in this corner, which is pretty nice instead of the complete um, screen, um, you know, Siri, um, as well as um, phone notifications now uh, just pop up in the corner. I'll just put in a um, quick like little animation of that. Um, it just pops out up in the corner instead of covering the whole screen, blocking your view of what you're doing. Another feature, um, this is just basically carrying over from um, iOS. Uh, I can just go here um, and say reply, and uh, you know, uh, I believe I should be able to uh, write this out, just be like, hello, and um, that will send in as a reply underneath this. Um, and you can see that link, uh, hello, um, right there. Another just uh, quick add-on feature that I uh, quite a bit like, I have some text written out here um, from the Apple Pencil and uh, we could just put this down, but uh, now you can actually select your um, text that you have written, you can copy, paste, do whatever you want there, and you can just go here and kind of like uh, pop it in right here. Okay, I can't get the paste to work for some reason. Um, other than that, I believe um, there is nothing really new here. Um, I mean, sorry, there's a ton of new things. Um, nothing really uh, other than that major that I would like to cover in this video. Um, again, I told you guys this is a pretty short one. Just a quick overview of um, what's going on in iPad OS 14. Um, obviously guys, if we just go here, this is iPadOS 14, uh, developer beta 1. Um, hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, guys, uh, please like, um, subscribe for more content. I'll be having, um, more videos about, uh, iOS 14 and macOS Big Sur coming up. Um, other than that, guys, um, yeah, stay safe and we out.